Welcome to lionfinds.com. Have you heard of trans fats? You probably have if you've been paying attention to any health information that's come out in recent years. Trans fats are said to have uh, some negative impacts on your health. The one I want to talk about today is how trans fats affect your brain. There have been studies that show that people with high rates or high levels of trans fats in their bloodstream have smaller brains than people who have low levels of trans fats. Now this is not a good thing because large brain capacity should help you resist things like Alzheimer's disease because that's one of the effects of Alzheimer's disease is it shrinks your brain. Um, so why would you want to shrink it ahead of time or at the same time add more shrinkage by using a lot of trans fats? It's not a good idea. Try to avoid trans fats. Trans fats are usually identified on packaging with the words hydrogenated. If you see the words hydrogenated or partially hydrogenated, look for something else. This is not the product for you. And manufacturers tend to say that things have zero grams of trans fats when in actuality they might have up to just under a half a gram per serving. And if a serving size is small, that's going to mean that if you eat lots of those little cookies or where, whatever it is, it might be that you're getting a lot of trans fats when you thought you weren't getting any. Take your vitamins B, C, D, and E, and don't forget your omega-3 your omega-3 uh, capsules, you know, those fish oil capsules the doctor always wants you to take, those also help with brain size. It said that people that have high levels of those vitamins are said to have larger brains. They've done tests and people with high levels of those vitamins in their system have larger brains.